Ra lên Dạ yeah. Hello cả nhà yêu ơi thì hôm nay mình đến nhà Glen and Gwen à, là cái hai người này đã làm à, mật ong trên 70 năm nay rồi rất có nhiều kinh nghiệm và dạ. organic honey very healthy good for everything definitely how so follow me uh, John with me đi với tiên nha <cười> Just, just, just beautiful plant. What the name of the plant? When and then? Yellow jasmine. Oh, jasmine. Wow, jasmine. Hmm. So um, this beautiful day today when? Lovely. Mm, gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Well, and the bicycle. The <laughs> head, the money, so that's the reason I've got all my things. Yeah. Uh, this is just some of our spare bee boxes and. Mm. Wow. Uh, I don't know whether you want it. Yeah. yeah. Anywhere uh, we just follow. Yeah, yeah. I've got one on my own. <laughs> Đây là chiếc xe Honda của Lennon Wen nha. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, you yeah, um, introduce. Yes. Mm. A frame out of a bee box and uh, the. Uh, Uh, oh, honey. Yeah, the uh, bees put the honey in that. They also put their babies in there. That's oh. why that's brown. Oh. And uh, that means that you can take that out, and take the caps off and extract the honey out of it. Oh. You know, and extract. So that's just what that's all about. Yeah. Oh, very good. Thank you for explanation, <laughs> uh, Wen and Len. Thank you so much. Right. Oh, then Vietnamese can listen. Yeah, cả nhà ơi, bây giờ là uh, Glenn and Gwen giới thiệu cho mình cách uh, lấy mật ong là cái 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 công nghệ ra sao nha. Cả nhà cứ nhìn và thấy nha. Đây. Yeah, cái, cái là nguyên thùng mật ong trong đó mình mở ra. Khi mình lấy xong mình bỏ vô đó, bây giờ mình mới đẩy lên bỏ vô cái um, cái hũ rồi mình đẩy lại nha cả nhà. Đó là công nghệ để làm mật ong. Yeah. Uh, that's because of the, in most cases, it's the um, uh, Banksias that grow oh. on Banksia Peninsula and Raymond Island. They go that far on a good mm. day to collect it. And yeah. it is a dark honey, but it's very nice, yes. High antioxidant, very high antioxidant. Yes. Cả nhà ơi, uh, Glenn mới giải thích là cái cái mật ong này được chiết xuất từ cái, 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 cái Banksia là ông nó hút xong nó làm mật thì rất là tốt cho nên cái màu nó hơi trát là cái màu nó hơi nâu đơ, sậm ở cả nhà nhưng có nhiều kháng thể cả nhà sẽ có thể dùng để sức da đẹp nè. uống nè với uống với nghệ nè rồi có thể làm những cái lip balm rồi very good very good for stomach with um, some um, uh, turmeric the best one so we go into make the medicine chuẩn bị mình làm thuốc từ mật ong nha cả nhà tại vì có những cái bác bác sĩ làm chung với mình sẽ cùng hợp tác với mình để sản xuất ra những loại thuốc làm từ mật ong cả nhà ủng hộ mình nhé that's, that's our, our kilo jar that we we have that's a half mm. kilo that's a kilo yes thì cái này là chai này là nửa ký nha cả nhà hay là một ký <cười> thì ở dùng nó gọi là new land arm rất là tốt the best the best, the best honey yeah, in the world yeah. the best honey in the world Absolutely. yes So, yeah. Okay. We, we also yeah. have. Yeah, you can tell something, Glenn. Containers. Hmm. Cái này là cái ba uh, ký nha cả nhà. Đây là một ký, còn cái này là nửa ký. Thì cả nhà mua loại nào cũng có hết, tùy theo túi tiền, cái nào cũng tốt hết. Cả nhà chia sẻ và ủng hộ Clan và Wen và Tiên and Ben. Very good. <cười> the, the, um... A lot of a lot of people prefer to have things in glass. That's the reason why we've got got, got both. Yes. But uh, for those, those people that like to have, uh, we're just happy to have it in plastic. We provide that for everybody. Yeah. yeah. But uh, the best way to take Vietnam, if the jam quite healthy, it's a better plastic, I think. Yeah. Better plastic. Yeah, I think way. the yeah, best way. Yeah. 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 So I will have about. Uh, uh, I think I get um. Maybe I try this one first. 
yes. about uh, five. Before. And then I will come back get more and more because two hours see so easy to take easy thing. Basically, they just sample. see yeah the sample, yeah, 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 and yeah. then I will get more and more. I guarantee yeah. you that. Thank you. So um, hôm nay mình sẽ lấy năm hũ mà cái loại 500 gram như cả nhà thì để mình đem về Việt Nam cho những người bạn bác sĩ mình sẽ nghiên cứu và chế xuất ra những cái loại tuyệt phẩm. The best. <cười> Ok, yeah. uh, cả nhà ơi, Ben và Len, so beautiful people. I just knew them not long ago, but it's just in my heart already. I will come back again and again to talk with them and do business with them. This, this, yeah, this, is, this is the main, hmm? one of the main tools. It's called oh. the smoker. Hmm. And it's got little bellows on it. And we yes. get a smoldering fire going inside oh. there. And wow. that calms the bees down. Oh yes, they they go very docile when oh. when you put smoke on them. Oh, then when I said I have to uh, explain to Vietnamese because some audience can't speak English, so I quickly to explain to them. Um, cả nhà ơi, when nói cả nhà biết cái này là cái gì? Một cái lò này để mà nó có cái những cái khói ở trong đây á. Khi mình lấy vật ong thì mình mở ra khói bay thì mật ong nó nó xỉn nó ngủ luôn thì mình cứ lấy mật thoải mái thôi cả nhà ơi. And that's just a, a ah. little piece of honeycomb, and you can have that. Oh, thank you, Glenn. <laughs> Glenn tặng mình cái này nha cả nhà. Glenn, give me this one for give to Vietnam. Thank you so much. Yeah, thì, yeah. um, thì um, cả nhà ơi, cái này là cái uh, cái sáp mật ong của cả nhà. Thì khi mình lấy thì còn như đây là rất là khéo. Beautiful. Honey yeah. sáp mật ong. <laughs> that there. Is... Wow. Pure beeswax. Wow. We've had that melted down. Look like a candle, isn't it? They make a candle for me, isn't it? Oh, you make candles out of I that? I can't yeah. get it. Yeah. Can you be? Yes, Len. Sorry. Well, Our sorry. grandson mm. and his partner make lip balm, and we sell that in the box, but we haven't got any at the moment. Oh. And li lovely little bowls of lip balm. Wow. Um, and they need the wax to use to, oh. to make the lip balm. Yeah. I love to see them one day to get for that for them, too. Because very good. Yeah, oh, very good. Let yeah. them know one day, Pixie will come and talk with them about yeah. the business with lip balm. Yeah. Yeah. Worldwide, we'll get when, it. When he was going to the grammar school in Sale, yeah. he got interested in beekeeping. Wow. And the interesting thing was that he then got some wax yeah. and he made some lip balm. Wow. Now, all the girls the at girls the school couldn't. just loved him. And he said... <laughs> It was so nice yes. for their lips and also, that. Also, uh, handsome more. <laughs> Look more and handsome. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ok, cả nhà thì yeah. Len mới nói mình cái này là cái sáp nha cả nhà. Cái sáp này có thể mình làm đèn cày nè. Rồi khi mà có những cái trong đây mình có chiếc xuất ra để mình làm những cái loại là cái cái tinh dưỡng, những cái loại mà uh, dầu mình để mình thoa môi thì beautiful lip. Look younger. Men look handsome, women look beautiful. Why not? Enjoy life. <laughs> Cái nhà ơi ủng hộ Ben và và Len nha. Look after Glen and Gwen. Thank you, Gwen. When, when, when I was Stay in my again. teens, I was like 14 at the time. I uh, traveled with my parents to Eagle Point. Dad was a school teacher there. We arrived in the dark, and it was the first time that we'd ever had electricity in the house. Wow. And mm. we were looking forward to that, but Dad didn't know that you had to contact the authorities to get this. It switched on. So we had another night in the dark. Yeah. But that night, we looked out the kitchen windows. There was only three houses in, in Eagle Point in those days. Mm. And the full moon came up over Lake King, and we thought we were in paradise. Wow. And so the next morning, the brother and I we went looking for uh, what's all about yeah. to see. Oh. And over the road, there was 250 beehives. And oh. I already had one hive, which we brought in the caravan with us. So I was in wow. a perfect place to learn more about bees because he was a very knowledgeable mm. uh, uh, gentleman. And now uh, we were living on the north side of where the bee boxes were. Mm. Now my grandson Charlie lives on the south side about the same distance away, but mm. they, they're not keeping bees anymore because yeah. he's passed on. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So yeah. just a, an interesting yeah. little twi twist ah. that, that happened. Yes, yeah, yeah, wow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I've 
just never lost interest in it. And my father did when he got his first sting. He said, "You're on your own, son." So uh, seventy <laughs> years, you told me seventy years. Uh, it was. I was nine when I got the first tiger. It was up wow. near Bacchus Marsh. Um, mm, that's just smart. I know that. And that's yeah. uh, that was the beginning of, of yeah. getting a, a hive, and uh, then we've now mm. progressed through. <coughs> excuse me, through a hobby to. Probably about 30 hives now, yeah. I got one of my friend, a doctor in uh, Bajut Mark Hospital. And uh, Bajut Mark in Melbourne, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I know there. Mm. And uh, can um, can you introduce yourself a bit so I didn't want to know who are you, please? Who am I? Yeah, so you talk to me and Ben video and introduce yourself. Yeah, well, my, my yeah. name's yes. Glenn. Yes. And uh, Glenn, my surname you. is Dyer. Uh, nothing yes. to do with the transport dyers of, of, yeah. <laughs> uh, on the highways, but yes. uh, spelt the same way. Oh. And uh, yes, I'm uh, going to be 84 years of age this yes. year. So yes. um, I've had a long time playing around with bees because I started... You look so young because you knew the honey. <laughs> so young. When the first time yeah, I met you, maybe. I can't believe he said he's 84. I told him maybe 60. His mother yeah. and father's. Both look very young. He's oh, got very good genetic. Good, yeah. good genetic. Maybe your kids the same. Yeah, yeah, our kids are beautiful. Yeah. Oh, I know. <laughs> I'm, not surprised. I'm yeah. not surprised. I'm not surprised. And so yeah. you say again. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so. And um, what do you do when you grow up after that? And where do you live from the first far? You well, we, we lived in Bacchus Marsh and we came to Eagle Point. And yeah. we've really been the Gippslanders ever, ever since oh. uh, 1954. Wow. Uh, you have. Yeah, well, yes. we, when we married, we mm. lived in Melbourne for two years. And yes. then we, I was in the police force and I transferred. You had a police force? Yes. Oh. Transferred to sale. Yeah. And uh, we were there uh, when the oil industry in Bass Strait started. Yes. And uh, through a couple of comments and mm. help from a few people, someone said, why don't you get a job out of Longford? Oh. And for 30 years, I was working at the plant at, oh, at, at Longford but, before I retired. Oh, yes. very small work. You said to me you work in the police port. And it just make me think, my dad Sam, he worked in police for a long time. Yes. He also the um, general for the army, my dad. Yeah. During the war, not yeah, now. Okay, yeah. So, um, small world. Small it? world, yeah. Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, mm. I, um, I think I racked up 37 years of shift work. Wow. <laughs> and when is the first time you met the beautiful Gwen? Well, we were living in... Uh, in Bans Gwen was living down in Warrigal. Oh, beautiful and place. And her father bought a business in Bansdale. Yes. And she came home... Uh, and got a job with a solicitor in Bensdale. Mm. And uh, she met a girl that she went to school with in Warrigal who yes. was having a 17th birthday. Wow. wow. And Jan and I had done a bit of sailing at the yacht club. Oh, you got the yacht club too. And she invited me to her 17th birthday. Oh, then when, something happened. When she yes. said to Jan, no, no, mm -hmm. I won't know anybody. She said, oh. oh, Margaret's coming, so that'll be fine. So she went down there. Now Margaret and Gwen were sitting in one corner. Yes. And Bruce Cole, a very good friend of mine, mm. he and I walked in. Yes. We were introduced to Gwen she's and Margaret. She's shy now. She's now. Yes. And Bruce married Margaret. I yes. married Gwen. Oh. And we're all still married. Oh. <laughs> see, I'm sure. Six, 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 Sixty-two years ago. And oh. and Gwen and Sue were very <laughs> beautiful. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful outside and inside. Until now, she's still beautiful. Oh, she's pretty good. Yeah. I know, I can tell. My we, sense we get of a few wrinkles and a bit out of shape. But... When, when uh, I have to say something about me, but I got uh, I was born in a shark, but the big baby, big baby um, egg. Uh, some people told me, Jesus, you yeah, were born like that. So I got a sense for number six. When I meet people, I never wrong. I can tell who good, who bad. <laughs> and if I know you good, I will come back again, again, annoy you. <laughs> no, no, I'm not annoyed yet. Not every day, only sometimes. But who oh, no good, I never see again. I got a sense of number six. <laughs> That's why I met him. I love him dry away. I'm very foxy with boy. No, no, I'm busy, busy. I'm no time for boy. But until I met him, that is, I'm in love. How long have you been together? Nearly four years. Very nice. Yeah, yes. so he's gentleman, loving, yes. caring. That's why I be with him. 
And uh, before, no, I have no time. I'm busy work and study. I come yeah. here. I want to get the doctor license again, but it's not easy. I um, I have no English. Uh, I can speak some Chinese. I can speak some Italian, French, and some Malaysian. Uh, not not all, but I can. Yeah. But unfortunately, no English. Why? Because after Vietnam War, no teacher for English. Mm. So what can I do? I study doctor. But it's no English. Then I learned here. I start from the zero. Have no family. No one help me. So I work. I work like donkey. <laughs> work so hard every day, three hours sleep to learn English and get the money. Have family back home because after war, yeah. all collapse, all how burn up the war, mm. and all plan. No more sharing with anyone. So I told mom, I come to Australia. I try to help my family up. Yes, I do. Studying it by myself, A, B, C, D. Learn from the library, from the newspaper, learn the television, learn from the book. Lucky I can talk now. But the problem is, I didn't have a general school for English. That's why I can't, I can't pass English for doctor. So. You're doing very, very well. Thank you. I think you're very clever. Thank I, you. I don't know. <clears throat> I went to school and they taught French. Yes. And I think that was a total waste of time. Yes. For that year. Mm. And my father obviously thought it was too, because that's why we came to Eagle Point, so mm. I could go to a tech school where I could yes. do my woodwork and mm. yeah. all those sorts of things. I'm a practical person. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, having said that, uh, the oil industry was very technical, very scientific in one sense. And mm. you know, uh, I, when I went to tech school, the teacher there tried to teach us about hydrocarbons. Yes. Yeah. I thought, what do I want to know that rubbish for? Mm. And it became 30 years of my life. Oh, <laughs> wow. So, so I was wrong on that one. <laughs> and, um, yeah. and when I got my English better, I got the ticket go to uh, with the the doctor to operation my spot. They already got, write me the letter for so there for three years around the world to help um oper operation for um, children for some people need help. So I already got the ticket. But you know what? When I found him, I can't go. He said, "Darling, don't leave me. I have to stay with him." <laughs> so what can I do? But I still enjoy. But I never get give up. I got my own YouTube channel, so I can work hard. The people know me. I do business, get some money to help charity in Vietnam. Yes. Yes. I did that 24 years ago, but still I never stopped. Because I think life is too short. If I can help someone, I help. When I die, I, I believe I can take anything with me. So if I got money, I want to share. Because after war in Vietnam, a lot of people suffering. Kids, yes. no parents. Grandfather, like elderly, elderly people yeah. know how to live, no yeah. government funding, yeah. no money. So mm -hmm. I always help them long time. But still now I want to I more work. All my money have, but I have myself, have family, have someone and have charity. Yeah. That's my truth. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, my truth. And yeah. thank you so much for everything to share in. No, and really, really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Yes, yes. yes. thank you. It's an interesting place mm. to be in my office. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I hate this world. That's all right. People in Vietnam, they're very blessed people. They, uh, they want to see the real thing. No worry. We happy person. One day I hope, I know that you can go to Vietnam to uh, see family. Of, you will love it. Why not? If you have a chance, go travel. You can stay in our empty resort. <laughs> Family, yeah. We got bed to run, we got food. And we don't do much but, traveling these yeah. days. <laughs> yeah. 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 I understand. And, that, I understand. and that's one of the reasons why we've given out more loans at this stage. Yeah. You know, they're talking about buying it. But yeah, I understand. Our caravan. Yeah. Uh, our daughter in, in Queensland. In Queensland. Mm. Uh, but they're. Uh, not able to use it very much at the moment. They used it for two days the, yeah. the, the other day because her husband's now, he's a concreter, mm. and he's working on the Tanamite, which is in central Australia, oh. just north of Alice Springs, 
Mm. And the interesting thing is they got uh, 230 millimetres of rain. Oh. He was, he was back on the Gold Coast for his week off. Mm. Yeah. And then he couldn't go back because it was just in a flood. Too wet to work. Too oh. wet to work. Oh. And now there's this other cyclone coming into uh, the Gulf of Carpentaria yeah. and they're anticipating that they'll get a lot of rain down there again. So he's mm. not too sure when he's going no. back to work. Mm. Yeah, so, mm. uh, so mm. that's the way it works. Yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. the, the weather patterns have been very poor for the beekeeping this year. Mm. With the wind and the, the, weather. the uh, regular bits of rain, and you'd think that that would help, but it washes the blossom out. Yeah, right. It, it makes the flowers grow, but then it yeah. washes the, the blossom. Yeah. And they can't gather it. Mm. And they can't gather it. Yeah. Mm. So uh, mm. it's farming. It's just one of those, mm. those yeah. things that creates a good years, bad years. Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah, mm. yeah. 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 And we, the previous year was extremely good. Yeah. And, <laughs> and, and my uh, oh, yeah. my squeeze, <laughs> uh, my always one um, the world uh, people and happy, happy. And um, everyone we live in the world like family, no war, no jealousy. Uh, That's what I love. That's one day my English getting better. I want to do something. My channel read more. I will say something. No war. War kill a lot of people. Not necessarily the war is a harm. A waste of everything. And yes. time and yeah, th things are not yeah, very happy no. in the world at the present moment for some strange reason. But we have grown up yeah. in a very special time where yes. everything mm. was very stable. Yeah. And, um, you know, uh, you just never ever thought of that. You could jump on a plane and, yes. and go to another country yes. for, a, for mm. a, a holiday or a tour yeah. and know it was all safe. But you can't now. Yeah. Uh, it's changed dramatically. But we yeah. just wonder what the world's going to be like for our grandchildren. Yes, got yes. And their children. Yes. We've already got two great grandchildren. Yes. And another one. And another one on the yes. way. <laughs> I the war come from jealousy. Yeah. Jealousy that it is no good. Yes. So have we have to stop jealousy. We have to think like we in this earth like the big family. We love we carry look after. No no fighting. Yes. Country and country like brother and sister. Yeah. So why not? Beautiful no. world. No. Why the joy? No, I want to say something, love. I want to say something. Mm. And I want that my dream, my dream to get everyone together. But by myself, I can't do anything. But hopefully, I got to avoid something. Mm. One day, I got some of my friends in the parliament. Um, uh, Brandon O'Connor used to be my friend. He's a very good person. I want to say something because. At least I got the world to say, mm. win happiness for everyone. That's what I want. Yeah, that's beautiful. Thank, yeah, thank you, thank you. I, I Very difficult to get everybody together. Hello, cả nhà yêu ơi. Đây là gia đình của Glen và Wen. A very beautiful uh, family. So good and have a nice day, Glen and you Wen. Very yeah, much. thank you. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Beautiful. I love you. Love you. You're too. so lovely. <laughs> Put you in my heart already. Thank yeah. you. Did you want